Specialization. When millions of specialists cannot exchange, they are helpless. In our country, survival depends on the integrity of the circulating medium, our money. Let me illustrate. So hi, my name is Roland Hernandez. I am the catcher for the Ball Busters. And my date is uh, proposing a little trip up to Malibu for like a day on the beach with surf lessons and picnic and all that, you know, food, beverages, good times. It's a combo date with my roommate and teammate, James, who I don't think he's going to make a movie, but he'll be at the party. So you're just going to be uh, appearing on video? I'm going to be on video. I might have like a cut out of myself. What was the worst spill you ever took surfing? Uh, I cut myself up pretty bad in Hawaii. My feet were bleeding. I, I went down and like got scraped up on the reef and coming in after that happened I stepped on a big sea urchin too so I had like all these quills and so sea urchin is that when someone has to pee on your feet yeah you're supposed to pee on your own but I just peed in the ocean so I was out of ammo and if you don't want to surf then that's fine too you know we can probably find something else to do on the beach beach blanket bingo or whatever you know so, so a little twist dancing yeah like yeah it. yeah something like that <laughs> so all right hope to see ya My name is Danielle Chase, and I'm a ballaholic. I'm from outside of Philadelphia. I try to help the world one pretty fucked up kid at a time. <laughs> Growing up in Philly, well, okay, so there were cobblestone streets, and they did away with them after a while. So what we used to do when we were bored is go around the streets and go rock hunting. So you have a collection of stones? Not anymore. <laughs> My date is to go to Disneyland. When was the first time you went to Disneyland? Not until I was 15. I was on like a teen tour. And what's your favorite ride? I don't know. I haven't been there in so long. I don't. I don't know. Like roller coasters. Roller coasters. Yeah. Fast ones. Yeah. Excitement. Yeah. Intrigue. Intrigue. Stuff like that. Yeah. Very good. Well, my name's Chuck McElvain. And I'm Oh my God, the camera's making me nervous! <laughs> All right, I can deal with it. Okay, you can do it. Just, you can do it. You can... Hi, hi, my name's Chuck McElvain and I live in the... Oh my God! <laughs> <laughs> my name is Chuck McElvain. I'm on Ace, Ace the Base. I'm kind of uh, proud of my date. And uh, I'd go on it alone if I actually had to. It's a day date, actually. And what it is, it's called Amazing Animal Encounter. <laughs> and it's not what you sick us thinking. It's, it's gonna have little monkeys. <laughs> and tigers and bears. It's going to be a day out at this ranch where uh, these movie animals are and we can pet little baby tigers and little baby bear cubs and meet a little monkey like this guy. Do they ever have to like discipline the animals there? <laughs> I don't know all the rules. I think there's a disclaimer and a waiver that you have to sign. Bad little monkeys! <laughs> <laughs> member of the Ball Busters. I'm a good old Midwestern girl from Iowa and I know how to call a cow. If you bid on me at the dating auction, you'll join me for VIP tickets to the Laugh Factory's All-Star Comedy Night in Jersey. How do you call a cow? Maybe I'll do it at an auction. <laughs> Maybe we should start over. I say auction again? Why? Because you say it funny. Oh, it's because I'm from Iowa! I <laughs> why I say it funny. <laughs> My name's Randall Montgomery. People call me London Benoit. I'm from the Ball of Hawks. I'm from the city of brotherly love. <laughs> now what I do is I'm a vice president of an indie record label entertainment company. Oh, the date is going to be, well, it's uh, TVA. Actually, you could um, figure out what that means a little bit later. <laughs> like that. <laughs> But for right now, I believe that we're going to do something, maybe some Malibu activities, maybe some surf lessons. I'll make a little sushi, we'll get some drinks, and that will just play it by ear, man. Who gives a shit, right? This is all for charity anyway. That's the main purpose, because I'm a giver. And to be honest with you, you know what? I just had a pretty bad loss, so I guarantee you two things. I guarantee you that on the day of the date that I'll be in a little bit more better mood than I actually am right now. And if you get me drunk enough, I'm going to actually... What? Good on me, yeah, it's all for charity, huh? I'm expecting at least $25, $30. That's what I hope. That's my goal. Adios. 
Hello, my name is TJ. I be a college graduate. Okay. Are, are, we, are we on? I play on the ball busters. Oh, that's not working. Okay. Hold up, take away the cue card. Okay, okay. 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 cool. All right. All right. All right. Hi, my name is TJ Lovelace, aka Dr. Love. If you pick me for your date, I'll treat you to a wonderful evening where you can treat you like a lady, go to the Griffith Observatory, and have a wonderful afternoon there, leading to a beautiful evening under the stars. And hey, no need to bring a jacket, because I'll keep you for the night. Uh, my name is Chris Yancey, and I'm a member of Tang. Tang Tang. Originally, I'm from Atlanta, Georgia. We moved to California six years ago. No, I mean, I, there's so many different kinds of people in LA. I don't necessarily think of the fact that I'm Southern as being anything special. Can you do a Southern accent? Darling, I can always do a Southern accent if I need to. If I've been pulled over going 100 miles an hour, I can try to talk my way out of just about damn near anything. My uh, date idea for charity is. Um, uh, come surfing with me up the county line, and then afterwards we'll grab lunch and beers at Neptune's Step. Well, I was really hoping that I wasn't going to have to give a lesson, so if you're bidding on me, hopefully you're not afraid of the ocean, you know how to swim, and you've been on a surfboard before. I'm sexy, I'm funny, and um, I'm like easy on the ice. Well, well, we quickly went from first date to yeah. something else. Yes. Paul Stanley, Westside Whackers, left field. Uh, fun fact about me is that I have my own TV show. It's called the uh, Monty the Mechanic Show. Uh, I play a mechanic. And as you can see, I'm very comfortable in front of the camera. Sort of. Fun facts. Quit looking at me. Stop it. Go away. Here's what I was thinking. Uh, I actually live in Hollywood. I don't live on the west side. So, lots of stuff to do in Hollywood. Lots of nice restaurants and bars and things. Do, do, do I need to be more specific? No. I don't, want, I don't want, I want to be specific enough so that you don't think that I'm going to like, you know, take them off in a car somewhere and just drop them off and leave them dead. So, it, you're more, you're more free form? Yeah, exactly. Organic, yeah. even. Absolutely. We're going to uh, play it as it goes. Pure freedom. There's no, we're not tied down to any specific restaurant, or theme, or place, or feeling. Maybe, maybe you could be a guest on the show if you're, you know, funny. I don't know. <laughs> Endless possibilities.